on. And even if it was, I don't know, three hours ago that I lost the game, there'll be games that it'll take me a day, you know, to, to get back to it. But there'll be games that after an hour, I'll be fine. And I don't need to make myself feel bad for something I didn't do well, because for me, having these negative feelings, they're not going to have any sort of advantage towards the next game. It's only being in a good mindset and in like a learning mindset. I almost like, I try to see my games in like a third person. You know, I try to Say more about to that. not judge myself. So when I'm watching Hector Bellerin play his last game, I'm not judging me, I'm judging Hector Bellerin. How did he do that? You know, so why, then it's like- Why is that useful? Because then I'm, I'm, it's not personal to me anymore. And I can, if he, that guy has done something wrong, I can say that to him, you know? Whereas if I say that to myself, maybe, you know, there's a bit of a barrier. So me, it's like watching Alexander Arnold play and I can say what he's done right and what he's done wrong. So it's kind of like this third person so gives you can me judge the, yourself on the same level, on the as, same you level as anyone else. So opposition. there's no nothing personal about it. And there's no like hiding behind anything or I, oh, but I didn't do this because this player should have done that. No. Okay. He did something wrong. He did something wrong. And then I can learn from that. And how did you learn that? That's a fascinating well, approach. I, I think, I don't know. I like to listen to your guys' podcast, for example, and I like to see like how ways I can improve. I think that seeing yourself as a third person that's something like even like Marcus Aurelius used to speak about and it's like ways of like you know becoming uh you know happier or like having a better life and there's things that they've been around for many many years and it's not that until you hear it from someone else or you hear someone putting it into the context of sport you start like realizing that you can really do these things but these things are not as you say like it'll be so easy to teach many players to to learn this trick or this, like seeing the something in a third person so they can really truly learn or like, for example, but you know, it's 